These crowds came from different parts of the country to take part in the public funeral of the former finance minister, Muhammad Shatah. Those we spoke to told us about their grief, their fear, and their anger. Muhammad Shatah was killed on Friday when his convoy was hit while he was heading to a meeting of the opposition bloc to which he belongs. He was known to be a voice of moderation, a man of dialogue who reached out even to his political opponents. His body was buried next to the former Prime Minister of Lebanon, Rafiq al-Hariri, under this tent. Rafiq al-Hariri was assassinated in 2005. Since then, many other figures were targeted or assassinated, and none of the culprits were brought to justice. With every killing, sectarian and political divisions deepen in Lebanon, in a country that is constantly moving from one crisis to another, and that is increasingly caught in the violence raging behind its long border with Syria.